John Huss was an early reformer in the Czech Republic. He stood for what he believed and it cost him his life. What were the issues that made him willing to stand up to the greatest power on earth? What convicts a person to be willing to die for their faith? As a forerunner to the Reformation of Martin Luther, it is very interesting that he also nailed six points of error against the church door at the Church of Bethlehem, just as Martin Luther, a century later, would nail his points against the Wittenberg door. The first error had to do with transubstantiation. Hus loathed the priests who boasted that they were making the body of the Lord Jesus in the Mass, and thus were the creators of their Creator. The second error had to do with the confession, which was demanded of the members of the Church. They were forced to confess, I believe in the Pope and the Saints. In opposition to this, Hus pointed out that all men are to believe in God only. The third error had to do with the pretensions of the priests to be able to remit the guilt and the punishment due to sin. The fourth was the implicit obedience demanded by ecclesiastical superiors to all their commands. Man, Hus said, must first and foremost be obedient unto God. Fifth, there was the error of not distinguishing between a valid and invalid excommunication. Hus spoke against the power of excommunication held by the ecclesiastical bishops who excommunicated members of the church at their own discretion and whim. And finally, the sixth error had to do with simony. This included the purchasing of church positions for money. By this, the Pope and the bishops were enriching themselves while allowing unlearned and unspiritual men to fill the offices of the Church. It's almost here. The first episode of the Conviction series will be released for the public only on ADTV.watch September 1st. Don't miss it.